This is the wind bubble. And this is the protection, the best protection that you can get for your lab mic. It comes in four different sizes and it's because you need to have the right size for your microphone. It's very important and that's the reason why it's called the wind bubble. That is you create a space inside so you get the best wind protection. I would like to show you how you find the right size for your lab mic. At the back of the cardboard you are able to see what kind of microphone this was built for. And it says COS11, uh, 4060 DPA and Sennheiser MK2 and so on. If your microphone is not listed here, you can always measure your microphone. This will fit for the microphones from 5 to 9 millimeters. So if you have your ruler, and then you will find your mic and then you will measure it and this is five millimeter well you can go for number two on that one so if you have l02 the two legs is only for finding the hole it's not for tying the things up or something like that it's only for finding the hole so you take, grab one of the legs and the other one and then you do like this and then you take your mic and insert it like this. And there you got your microphone with a bubble beyond. So this was the L02. We can take another microphone. We can take a smaller one and then we can measure it this is the dpa 66 and that's a three millimeter microphone in diameter so we know that the three millimeter is this is what we're looking for number one l01 it's from three to four millimeters. So if it's not listed, take your ruler and measure it. And this is the one for the 6060 DPA. Spread the legs like this and insert your mic. Like that. And here you have it. It is very important that you draw a little bit back so you create the space inside of it some space inside the wind bubble that's what you need read more about our wind bubbles and our other sound accessories on bubblebeeindustries.com thank you